Good morning. Governor Pritzker, who does not yet have a COVID-19 news briefing scheduled, has indicated he wants to wait to see where the numbers are after New Year's before deciding whether to ease restrictions. The post-Thanksgiving surge wasn't as bad as health officials had feared. The metrics, including the positivity rate and number of people in the hospital, are on the decline. Several counties in our viewing area, except suburban Cook, Lake, and McHenry, have the met the metrics the state uses. This would affect capacity in stores, gyms, whether restaurants could serve indoors again. Sunday, Illinois Department of Public Health reported 4,469 new cases, another 81 people died. The state is attempting to ramp up its vaccinations of frontline health care workers and residents of long term care facilities. The vaccine distribution, though, has gotten off to a slow, chaotic start. The federal government has distributed 14 million doses of vaccine, but only 4 million shots have been administered. The goal was 20 million shots by the end of December. Chicago Mayor Lori Lightfoot tweeted this weekend Chicago has already distributed 95% of the vaccine doses it has received. However, at the current rate of allocation, it would take 71 weeks nearly a year and a half to fully vaccinate the entire city. We need more vaccine now. Dr. Anthony Fauci says the pace is picking up. He says a half million people have received the vaccine each day in the last three days, offering a glimmer of hope. We are not where we want to be, no doubt about that. But I think we can get there if we really accelerate, get some momentum going and see what happens as we get into the first couple of weeks of January. Illinois has received 400,000 doses of vaccine. About 170,000 shots have been given. In the newsroom, Judy Wang, WGN News.